Michigan, which borders Vance's home state of Ohio, is a key swing state in this election. So what does his selection mean for us this November? Team coverage continues tonight with 7 News Detroit reporter Brett Cast, who spoke to a number of local voters and a political science expert to hear their thoughts on this GOP ticket. Well, many voters have such strong opinions about the top of the ticket that the running mate really doesn't sway their vote. But that's not the case for everyone in Metro Detroit. For the office of Vice President of the United States, Senator J.D. Vance. I love him. I think it's a great idea. Hey, I think it's an excellent pick. Reactions spreading quickly among Republican voters in Metro Detroit, hours after J.D. Vance was announced as Donald Trump's running mate on day one of the Republican National Convention. I thought it was a clever choice. I like the pick also because he's young. We need a young vice president. I feel like a lot of our politicians are getting a little older. The 39-year-old senator from Ohio is the first millennial to be on the ticket for a major political party in the U.S. It's a very logical pick in some ways. Which Eastern Michigan University political science professor Jeffrey Bernstein says is not surprising. In some ways, Vance balances the ticket around age, around geography, but in other ways, and particularly in terms of ideology, I think it is reinforcing um, who Donald Trump is. But Bernstein still expects the pick to have a minimal impact on the outcome. Not a lot of people are undecided when it comes to a Trump-Biden election. So it's unlikely that a vice presidential candidate is going to have a tremendous impact on the vote. He can pretty much pick anyone because Trump is a winner. We love Trump. While that's true for some voters. Yeah, independent, undecided. As we learned, it's not true for all. Do you think now more than ever that you're considering or looking more closely at VP candidates more than the normal? I think it's pretty important now more than ever, yeah. So while it's unclear if Vance could have any impact on the outcome here in Michigan, experts say picking a young candidate with Midwest roots is a good choice. If there is any spillover effect into Michigan and Pennsylvania, which of course border Ohio, then I think that's an added bonus of this pick. If there's a small percentage, like maybe like three to five percent of people that are um, on the fence, I think this helps Trump. Now we have received multiple statements from Democrats regarding this selection, including the chair of the Michigan Democratic Party, Lavora Barnes, who said in part, quote, Trump has only ever surrounded himself with extremists who agree with his far right agenda and J.D. Vance is certainly no different. Meanwhile, the chair of the Democratic National Committee, Jamie Harrison, added in part, quote, this is the most consequential election of our lifetimes. And with Donald Trump's decision today to add J.D. Vance to the Republican ticket, the stakes of this election got even higher. In Oakland County, I'm Brett Cast, 7 News, Detroit.